previously on I've been waiting for you damn my bad yeah yeah the line at the car wash super long took me forever your attempt at humor is wasted Ew. our targets are in together we have a chance of course. I admire Mr. Beignet a great deal but we can't tell him about this plan it's his people we'll be fighting I will talk to my friends meet me here tomorrow if I don't make our appointment assume the worst this is a delicate operation are you okay if we have to use violence? Good question. If we find ourselves in that position, we pull the plug and wait for another opportunity. We can't risk anyone's life over this. There he is. He's been on top of this damn building the whole time I was trying to find him inside? Damn, Fallout 4, why can't you say speak with father at the top of the roofs of the the ruined institute place? But nah, you just have to be so general that I was basically lost for a hot minute. Yeah, he looks pissed. You know, in all my years, I've never set foot outside the institute. Not once. Since the day they brought me here. I've never had a reason. But now, this just confirms the truth I've always known. The Commonwealth is dead. There's no future here. The only hope for humanity lies below. Some air fresheners, a new coat of paint, and it'll all be good as new. If only it were that simple. Standing here... I'm reminded of how fortunate I am that I was spared a life in this wasteland. I know that to you, I was kidnapped from that vault. In truth, the Institute rescued me. Both of us, really. They left me on ice. For 60 years. Yeah, they man. Did. And for good reason. For what? I was the perfect candidate. An infant with uncorrupted DNA. But if something were to go wrong, if I died, well, the Institute realized a contingency plan was prudent. Another source of pre-war DNA, preferably related to their primary subject. It only made sense that my parents should fill that role. So you were kept alive and safe within the vault. I'll admit, when I had you released from Vault 111, I had no expectations that you'd survive out here in all this. Damn. To not only do so, but manage to find me. To infiltrate the Institute itself. Extraordinary. Your unconditional love is overwhelming. I think I need a moment. I can accept that you're offended. You must understand, though. I have had no love to feel. Damn. We have been strangers until now, you and I. Certainly it was no longer necessary to keep you suspended. I... Well, I suppose I wanted to see what would happen. An experiment of sorts. Well, fuck would you too. Would the Commonwealth too. corrupt you? As it has everything else. Would you even survive? Perhaps most curious to me. Would you, after all this time, attempt to find me? And now I know the answer. Well, here I am. Was it worth it? I believe so. Soon, I hope. I hope you'll understand. Everything I've done has been for the future. A future which I hope is not in jeopardy after recent events. Bunker Hill did not go well for us. Would you care to explain what happened? We were totally ambushed. They were waiting for us. You can imagine that I find that very hard to believe, huh. given that all the intelligence leading up to this indicated we'd taken them by surprise. Yeah, he's Bunker pissed. Bunker Hill was to cement your place as a valuable asset to the Institute. It will now only raise suspicions. And to see the Brotherhood of Steel involved in this? They had no way of knowing what was going on. I will refrain from sharing the outcome with the Directorate for the moment. 
things are already in motion that this would only derail. Speaking of which, it's time for you to become more involved in the future of the Institute. You I'd still like want you to me join to? join me inside. The Directorate is meeting, and you should be there. I'll be waiting. I've seen enough. It's time to go back in. I am so surprised that he still wants me to come with him, even though I not only lied to him, but also aid in on the ambush. <laughs> like, ooh, this should be very funny indeed. Ooh, my goodness, I can never get over. Honored to welcome you here. Yeah, for now, until you realize what I actually did in Bunker Hill, but whatever. Fuck this place. Seriously. I just can't really stand by the Institute. For him to go outside... To call it a wasteland, to have that entitlement of, Oh, thank god, I was raised and live in the institute like fuck you bro not everyone was privileged to have been spoon fed into a life Let's and even then meeting over with before we speak further it's well it's important okay whatever either way all of y'all so full of shit pisses me off oof my goodness where am i gonna sit should I stand? Good, we're all here. I think it's time we begin. Sir, excuse me, but what exactly is she doing here? I will address that issue. But there are other subjects that require our attention first. The level of unrest in the Commonwealth continues to rise, as we're all aware. Your report. All Institute facilities remain completely secure, with the exception of one notable breach. Otherwise, internally, things are as tight as they've ever been. Dr. Ayo has been keeping an eye on things topside. Yes, um... Watchers show no additional threats beyond those previously identified. We're still monitoring the increased activity around Ford Independence, but there are no immediate signs we should be concerned. Boston International Airport remains occupied, with Brotherhood presence noted at several other points throughout the Commonwealth. Intelligence suggests that this railroad continues to operate and is becoming more... ambitious. SRB agents are monitoring all known situations, sir. Very good, thank you. It's clear that our safety needs to be the primary concern going forward. To that end, where are we on phase three? Uh, sir, are you sure this is the time to be discussing it? Given, well, considering all parties present? Meaning ah, me. Yes, that's true. Have you heard anything about phase three? What's phase three? It's very important to us. Power is, as I'm sure you've seen above ground, a very valuable commodity. I'm not talking about some abstract concept of control. I mean real, tangible power. The kind that keeps the lights on. With every advance the Institute makes, our need for raw power increases. Many compromises and sacrifices have been made over the years to allow progress to continue. Right. Such hard times down here. I would never disagree that life in the Institute is better than above ground. We have done much to ensure it. Now, we take things even further. Phase 3 is simply the activation of a nuclear reactor that can provide enough power to the Institute now and forever. It will ensure not just our survival, but our prosperity. Can you tell me more about this reactor? Certainly. It was originally built for the Commonwealth Institute of Technology before the war, but was only for testing. Over the years, we've advanced the technology, made a great many improvements, and are finally nearly ready to activate it. The reactor is close to ready, but recent tests have determined we have a few tasks ahead of us. Thus, we come to phase three, and to how you will help. Sir. Oh, Lord. Yes, Dr. Ayo. Previously, we would rely on Kellogg for above-ground operations, yes? Well, he is gone. 
While I am not overly fond of putting my own mother in harm's way, she has proven more than capable of handling herself. Uh, y yes but... This is not a matter for debate. Now, there is one more subject that requires discussion. I don't know that this is the time. Dr. Holdren, it is time. Please, as I'm sure several of you are already aware, I have been under Dr. Volkert's care for some time. I'm sorry, this is difficult for me. What do you Our mean? Our best efforts have failed. Every experimental treatment we could devise has been unsuccessful. I'm... I'm sorry to say I am dying. What? Oh my Please? god. Please. I just I'm met sorry. you and you're dying. Really? This is not how I wanted to tell you. But we're running out of time. This can't be happening. I only just found you. I've had the same thoughts more than a few times. But we cannot let this stop us. Our work must continue. We can talk more later. Right now, the future of the Institute is at stake. The Institute cannot survive without leadership. The Directorate must continue to govern with the best interest of all in mind. To that end, I am naming my mother as my successor. Oh, what? Boy. You can't be serious. Really? Seems a poor choice. Damn. Must be justified this. She isn't one of us. She isn't even a scientist. They're pissed. Your borderline insubordinate tone. I will simply say this. Yo, the out of line. has enough scientists. What it needs is a leader. I believe my mother has already proven herself more than capable in that regard. This will conclude this meeting. Thank you. Unit B-592 is undergoing the reclamation process as we speak. Before long, he'll be back in the workforce. The latest synth generation is just amazing. Don't Those fucking talk to me, Clayton. All you sons of bitches ain't shit. Outsiders. I hope you can appreciate Fuck you, Ali. Y'all just talk shit about how I'm going to be the leader of the Institute. So, whatever. Look at them trying to kiss ass now. Bro. What the fuck? I found you, and now you're Hello, dying. Mother. Enjoying your time here. Oh my god. No, I'm not. I had no idea. I know this is... Well, it's a lot to take in at once. I'm sorry, Mother. I hope it wasn't too presumptuous of me to put you in charge without even asking first. What would it mean to be in charge? Most divisions of the Institute are fairly autonomous. Perfectly capable of functioning without intervention. Where those divisions interact, however, problems can arise. You'd lead the Directorate in setting policy, resolving disputes, and the like. There's no question that some of the Directorate, and the Institute at large, will need reassurances about your appointment. That's why I'd like you to take charge of this latest operation. Dr. Fillmore can fill you in on the details. There are hard decisions ahead for all of us, but for you especially. I know that you'll do the right thing. What the fuck, man? My son has so much faith in me, and I betrayed him. I'm not scared of the surface. Allie. Busy day for you, isn't it? Well, it's about to get busier. You're going to lead this operation, I'm told. I need some details here. I have no idea what I'm getting into. Of course. That's why we're talking. Otherwise, you'd be up top already. Okay, smartass. Set our timetable. Getting the reactor online has become our number one priority. It needs to be running, well, yesterday. We're going to have to cut some corners. I'm not thrilled, but it means we'll need to rely on some pre-war tech. You're going to the Mass Fusion Building to acquire a beryllium agitator for us. Ah, man. I have one of those, but it's in my other pants. You wouldn't recognize one if it fell on your head. That's why I'm going to retrieve it. Sounds good. I'd appreciate the company. Not as much as I'd appreciate coming back in one piece. I don't like going above ground unless there's no other option. But here we are, with our options dwindling quickly. Not to put more pressure on you, but we have to move quickly on this. 
Word is that the Brotherhood is nosing around the area. Okay, and they can keep on nosing. Before we do, head on up to the relay, and I'll meet you there. Of course. All right. So, question is, where is this relay? I mean, hold on. All right, relay mass fusion. Lord have mercy. Uh, I guess I'll go to the main entrance of said institution. If you require maintenance, please file a report with the facilities division. <laughs> I require emotional damage because I betrayed my son, and yet he still believes in me. And is giving me a second chance. And wants me to lead the institute. Like, what the fuck? I just don't know what to do or say at this point. I don't agree with the institute. I don't believe their philosophy. I think they're pretentious, pompous little assholes. that use science to dehumanize and belittle people. But if I become the leader of the institute, I can actually undo a lot of their policies, change up a bit. Maybe even have the Institute work with the Wasteland instead of working against the Wasteland. I don't know. I just... I need to think it over. Relaying to mass fusion will make you a permanent enemy of the Brotherhood of Steel. Are you sure you wish to proceed? I don't give a fuck. Let's go. Oh, I failed a mission. Foul support. Then again, I just... I don't know. Honey, going through is my middle name. I'm not afraid of these Wait, little shitheads. What was that? Ooh, hell yeah. I can't wait. Ew. They are so... I don't know, I feel like the Brotherhood of Steel is more like a cult instead of an actual army, but whatever. Fuck. Hold on. I got injured, so let me put on my shimmy. Stimmy stim steamy. Only five? Damn, that sucks. Anyways, come on. Come on. Oh shit, this is not gonna end well for me. I can sell. I literally have like a good four stimmy left. And his suit is eating up a lot of my attacks too. Come on! Die! Come on! Thank you. Oh my god. Okay. Now I'm good. Lord, they're so delusional. Totally delusional. Huh. Alright, let's go. Ooh! Ooh! Anyways. Oh, shut the hell Don't up. The card. No, that'll get us anywhere. At least not without whatever card activates it. So, your guess would be... Yeah, I'm going up the stairs. Manually, I guess. Either way, it's right there, so... Nice. Just some tags, I guess, but... All right, we got it. Ooh. The agitator. We'll have to search the rest of the building. No way I'm cracking this. The hell is this? Calm down, Noel. You knew that this was coming. I don't understand why you're acting this way. Don't tell me to calm down, Carl. When we started designing the beryllium agitator, you said it would be for the benefit of mankind. Instead, 
I find out that you have been planning on turning it over to the military all along. You lied to me. Don't give me that high and mighty attitude. Have you picked up a newspaper lately? There's a war going on out there, Doctor. And if our side's going to win, it needs all the help it can get. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Since when did science start taking sides? What did they promise you, Carl? Money? Political favors? A goddamn medal? That's enough! Like it or not, when the testing cycle is completed, I'm crating up the agitator and sending it off to Washington. Now, you have two choices. Either you can get back to work, or you can get the hell out of my building. Damn, okay. Dr. Fillmore, let's hope the Brotherhood hasn't beaten us to the agitator. Oh, I don't know what to do. Hacking this is beyond me. Okay, let me see here. I have not used any of my points, so... Hacking. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Really? Hacker. What the hell? I have to be a level 33. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, yes! Perfect. Alright, so let me see here. I'm going to try a couple things. Thank God I had enough skill points to actually pick out my hacker ability. Um, let me see here. Okay, I got rid of fake passwords. A third one. That's beautiful. Not too bad. Let me see if I can find another one. Ooh. Yeah! Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six... Seven words that are possible to pick. Okay, less than that. Okay, whatever. Yes! Beautiful! Alright, so I have here one, two, three, four, five. Five possible passwords and four tries. Damn, should I? Hmm. All right, I'm going to start. Got it. Oh, thank God. Okay, so I'm not going to read all of that because I don't care. But now we know where it is, so. Ooh. Nice. All right, let's go to the reactor. Hmm. 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 I'm very tempted to read it, but at this oh, point, yeah. fuck it. I like how I just left the scientist too. That's really how I feel about her. Damn, how far down are we going to go? Nice view. Are we here yet? Like, ooh, it's dark, it's dark, I don't like it. Damn, that's a lot. How the hell did you? Oh, Kate, thank God. At least Kate is coming with us. Kate. I'm so happy you're here. It's an ambush. What? Oh, fuck me. Bye. Got one. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna kill as much people as I can. This is gonna be so fun. Look at that, look at that. Come on. Come on. Come on. Whatever. 
V's Brotherhood of Steel is crazy, people. Like, I know based off of what I read that that Brotherhood of Steel likes to collect technology and stuff, but I don't know. The fact that they consider Sims to be monsters and they would rather kill them instead, I'm not really, I'm not really feeling that. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's clever. I'll give them Someone Oh shit! This is oh shit! Oh my god! Come on! Oh my god! I can't even do anything. Okay, hold on. Another stimmy. They are really, really. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, there's no way. There's no way for me to hide. Move, Valley. Okay, good. At least I have some breather. Oh, shit. Shit! Anyways. Ew. I hate this. I have one steamy left. This is bullshit. Wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? Duh. You work smart, not hard. This place about to blow. Okay, I forgot. I forgot you were there. I'm sorry. Come here. Boom! That's the point, honey. That's the point. Alright, let me change my gun. <laughs> Fucking whore. There you go. There you go. Adios. This mission is pretty crazy. I give you that. Alright, so it should be right around here. This is it? That should do it. Elevator ought to have power again. Okay, so what do we do? Like, I don't get it. We did an optional quest. Proceed to the reactor level. Oh my god, okay. So where is the reactor level? Like... This is annoying. Nope. I like how his flashlight is still here. No, really, I feel like I'm getting lost. I hate this shit. Alright, I think we should be- Oh, it's all the way down there. Okay, let's go. I'm sorry, Kate, you're too slow. This is scary. That statue is not giving me welcome here vibes at all. Oh great, more people! What the fuck? I guess I gotta go get fat man, because you know what? Works work hard, not smart. I mean sorry, work smart not hard. Anyways. Oh my god, who the hell is shooting me? Fuck off. Who's here? Asshole. Oh, it's a legendary enemy. Oh my god. Anyways. I'm not trying to get killed, so... Good, he's dead. That's it? Perfect! Yay! Alright, this is... This is it, I guess. Thank you so much for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.